Here's Papa Dale, and I'm about ready to vote for freedom, dropping my ballot right here in my local ballot collection box. Yabba dabba doo! <laughs> there she is! That is the source of the human effort for freedom in the United States. Of course, the true source of freedom is Jesus Christ. But you got to do your part. So I'm here to vote for freedom. <laughs> there it is. There's my ballot. And it is going in right here. Woo! There she goes! Ha 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 ha! <laughs> well, here's Papa getting some limbs taken off of some of my trees. And uh, we got an expert limber here doing the work who happens to also be my nephew, uh, David Kennard. He's an awesome kid, uh, about 30 years old, and uh, works for uh, Tacoma Power. Uh, as a lineman, so he's got really strong legs. He can just climb those trees <laughs> We'll get more pictures in a bit Well, you know what they say, it's easy when you know how. <laughs> well, so uh, Dave did a great job on these trees over here. Let's take a look. Look at all these green pine branches that have come down here. When you look up that tree and you go up I guess he went up maybe 50 feet that was higher than I thought that we would end up going but it worked out we cleaned that all off real nice so this next tree is I guess probably the uh, thickest and he's not certain that his uh, belt, his rope, will reach all the way around it. He doesn't have to go nearly as high, but it's the, the reach around that is the issue on that tree. You've got this uh, skinnier tree here. That one's no problem. He'll be able to go up that one, just uh, lickety split. Might be able to reach over and get some of the branches on this one, but... I don't know. I don't know if you can do that. But uh, we'll see. Well, I guess we're doing this one next. It's, it's not as big around as uh, the bigger of those last two, so it should be no problem. The concern here is the uh, electric service lines coming in. I'll show you. So we got this power pole right here next to the tree. And as the power pole goes up, of course, being a power pole, it's connected to power. Haha, <laughs> big surprise. And so you got some power lines up there. But Dave knows how to handle that, being a uh, lineman. Uh, in his Monday through Friday job, he, uh, he knows how to be careful around those and the importance of being careful around those. So I trust that he can handle it and uh, not get himself hurt. That's the most important thing. Ah. 
Uh, I got an infestation of uh, English ivy all over my property. Stuff is really a pest. Years ago, uh, the former owner apparently thought that it was pretty. Planted a little bit of it and it's grown over 20 years or so to take over everything. Hey Dave, give me a wave. What? Give me a wave. <laughs> <laughs> well, here's a little interlude in the midst of Dave's limbing the trees for me at Papa's place. Uh, this uh, is a family story that um, I used to tell just about every time I would see Dave and tease him because I'm a big tease with all my nephews. And uh, now that he's 30 years old and all grown up and uh, he's probably tired of thinking about it or hearing about it, so I... Uh, I studiously didn't say anything to him about it while he was here, but I got to get it on the video for posterity's sake. When Dave was about, oh, maybe 11 or 12 years old, and his younger brother was maybe 10 or 11 years old, uh, they were in the back seat of my car. I was taking them somewhere, I don't know. And uh, Dave thought that uh, 
he would tease me back. I was teasing him about something or other. And Dave thought, well, I'm going to get Uncle Dale and I'm going to tease him back. And so uh, after I said something, Dave said, oh, uncle, you're just a, you're just a monkey's uncle. <laughs> and, and I sat up tall and eyes real bright and big. And I said, hey, Dave, he said, what? I said, if I'm a monkey's uncle, what does that make you? And I looked in my rearview mirror as the light dawned on him and his eyes got big and he said, oh, uncle. <laughs> this is one of my favorite stories of my uh, uh, uncle or my uh, nephews and, and nieces um, as uh, my life uh, progressed. <laughs> I'm a monkey's uncle, and boy, the way he climbed those trees at Papa's place, I guess he really is the monkey. <laughs> yada da da doo Yeah, this is the scariest part to me right there, getting those branches from around that electrical service. But uh, Dave doesn't seem to have a problem with it. He knows what he can do and what he can't. That sure cleaned up that service line all the way in there to the power pole. I like it. That's really nice. So we got the pickup here. Dave's up on the ladder. And we got to go up and uh, grab a branch and try to pull it down and cut it. Papa and, uh, Papa and the nephew. <laughs> Changing the YouTube channel from Papa and the Bandit to Papa and the Nephew. <laughs> This is Dave. Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. And uh, Dave did all of this awesome limb work for me. And uh, I couldn't be happier. Well, I guess I could. He could also, you know, dump a truckload of $100 bills behind him as he's <laughs> leaving. But that isn't going to happen. So I guess I'm as happy as I'm going to get. But take a look at how much uh, open sky I can see now. Isn't that awesome? Yes, sir, e Bob, and look at all of this uh, sunshine down in that area where I'm going to have my raised vegetable garden beds. It's great. It's uh, awesome. So uh, thank you so much, Dave, for the work. I appreciate it a lot. Short notice even, almost last minute. And uh, my uh, vegetable garden thanks you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, but I'm a new.